Nice Rain here. Welcome back to my Grim Horizon XCOM 2 run. Okay, um, so I have a, a Ranger with Conceal, so I am going to use that to get some free scouting. Okay. Yeah, I'll just get my Heavy Lancer up there. Servos at maximum. Right, I didn't expect to not run into any enemies. Copy that. Got it. When double moving on my first turn. Affirmative. Rolling out. All right. So with any luck, some of the pods will walk into my vision, and that'll cancel everything and uh, attack the the resistance. It is a lot of health that I'm going to have to get through. Well, resistance soldiers do 6 damage now, so that's... Uh, they can actually single-handedly kill some of the... You know, some of the enemies without any help. I never removed this trait. Huh, okay. Um, okay. Well, let's see. Stun Lance does... 5 to... Oh, interesting. Doesn't do more damage to sectoids. I don't know, maybe that's like a display bug. Okay, anyway. The sooner I use Overdrive, the sooner I get it back. I have a plan where I might end up... Suppression um, in Ramada. And then moving my Stun Lancer next to it. Do Stun Lancers. They have 10 defense. Okay, so there would be a 5% chance of this Andromeda hitting my Stun Lancer. If I were to give him. If I were to give the Andromeda minus 50 aim from Suppression. Okay, anyway. I am going to, well, okay, I want to kill as many enemies as possible. Did I bring blue screen rounds on anybody? It does not appear so. Um, okay. And I didn't bring the Shadow Keeper either. I need to... On your order. I need to do that. I need to bring the Shadow Keeper. Okay. Nice. Guaranteed hit. Asset located. X-ray neutralized. All right. What do I shoot then? Maybe instead of uh, planning Moving to, out. maybe I just kill the Andromedon, and then the shell might. Hit. Some damage to somebody, so I guess I'm gonna have the stun lancer. I'm gonna have the stun lancer attack it. All right, what do we have here? It's a good try. Um, okay, I just wanted that armor shred. I just wanted to compete for that armor shred at this point. Eighty percent did the sectoid. Well, might be the best. Oh, nice. Well, 
Well, the only guaranteed kill I have, well, I guess I have like combat protocol. Well, I have the, I have the stock. That's the only guaranteed kill I have. Um, all right. The heavy lancer is expendable, but I still I don't want to just I don't want to completely throw away its uh, throw away its health. Uh, okay, I didn't account for the fact that it can't actually target the insectoid. Five health remaining on the Berserker. I'm on it! Alright. X-ray neutralized. And ninety percent. Can my ranger... Okay, my ranger can make it... Where does my ranger... Where should my ranger go? I think my ranger should go here. It's the Time least likely it. spot for the specter to check. Hostile got me flanked! Okay. Reduced. Hopefully I can kill that next turn. So my, my Heavy Lancer position. currently has 40 defense. So the 65 aim Andromedon punch will only have a 1 in 4 chance of actually hitting. Oh! He's just running away. They're onto me. I'm being flanked! Okay, so he's just that that Commander, one is ignoring our forces just to get a better off. shot They've at the civilians. They've got units in the AO that are ignoring our forces just to get a better shot at the civilians. Take those bastards down! Oh wow! And max level resistance soldiers really do a lot of damage. Moving to designated position. Target eliminated. Wait, did they bring blue screen rounds on this guy? Nope, I brought armor piercing rounds. What about this guy? Aha, blue screen rounds. Heading well, specters are vulnerable to blue screen rounds. So will be fine. Hostile the Andromeda shell has a lot of health. The resistance team is but in the clear. They do have a whole They're team moving to help the other survivors. There's a large group of civilians pinned down within range of your position. Sensors indicate hostile forces are closing in fast. We need to get in there before the aliens slaughter those people. All right. Um, I'll have my sharpshooter get the get the loot because Heading out. she has a grappling hook, so she'll be able to get back into position. I have the asset. What? Yeah, that was weird. Oh, I got a superior or something. I wasn't paying enough attention, but yeah, it looks like I got some good loot. Got a superior or something and an Illyrian core. Okay. Well, my spark is a Coming. major, so I don't need to give more kills to it. Unless, of course, this 90-second shot. Hostiles pacified. I've only had that happen a few times before. I think it's pretty rare for a 99% to miss. Alright, it's time for chrysalids. 
my first time fighting Crystal, I don't even remember. I feel like it is. Ah. Okay, spark. Oh well, let's get my let's get my stun lancer up there. Hopefully, you can t can take a hit or two for the resistance soldiers. counting a summon though from the uh, inspector and I don't remember what else high speed advance Roger that got it covered go 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 all right um, yeah this should not be close enough to walk into a faceless got it Oh, I forgot about tactical analysis. Oh yeah, and the resistance soldiers have nine health. Well, we're officially fighting. Chrysalids can move and attack with the same action, so I might, uh, nice. Miss again? Oh, darn. Oh, man. The chrysalids on retaliation missions are pretty rough because of those goons that they leave. Or nests, or whatever the heck. Hopefully, they still got some forces that are. They got some units that are ignoring our forces just to get a better shot at this build. They do have the, uh, the shredder, uh, shredder gun. use that. Do I have my overdrive back? Not even sure. Well, let's see. I have, oh, two turns on it. Not even, not even one turn away. Two turns away. Okay, so I want to hit the, uh, the cocoon, which is, it has two spaces between it and the berserker, so I need, so you need to figure out the shape of the cone I can make. Oh, okay, I can't move any farther back if I want to hit the specter. So I guess I'm just gonna move to the side like this. Um, yeah, there's no way I can hit the Berserker and the leftmost Chrysalid, so I'm going to prioritize the Chrysalid. Multiple units eliminated. Okay. This Frost Bomb can hit both of the... If I get closer, I think I'll be able to throw it onto the tree and that'll be able to freeze the Mutant and the Berserker. Okay. Um. We don't have Blade Storm on anybody. Oh, okay. Alright, our, uh... On the move! 
think our grenadier can use a grenade from here. Okay, cool. Catch! We didn't need very much damage to kill the chrysalid. I think I want to freeze all this. I'm not sure. Well, if I go here, if I run and gun, go over here and kill this muton, I think that's guaranteed. From, yeah, from two spaces away, Plus 35. Okay, cool. Enemy down. They might have had a small chance of not actually getting a kill. Like a low roll non crit or something. We have so much aim that we don't need high ground, so I'll just get a better angle for next turn. Heading there now! Alright. Can you freeze a chrysalid cocoon? That's what I'm wondering. Guess we'll find out. This is for you! <laughs> I forgot that that's a little quirk that happens when you freeze civilians. They, they're like permanently panicking, but they lose the panicking status effect. They still don't do anything. Rebel they're just out. funny. I should have tried to freeze it or something. Okay, cool. So that's a guaranteed kill. We can't hit anything with frostbite. Is the cocoon is immune? That would that would make sense. Affirmative. Moving out. Um, I'm gonna try to Overwatch. I'm on it. Whatever pops out of it. Good. I'm pretty sure Crystal Spawn are immune to, or sorry, the Crystal Spawn have low enough health that they can die to to just an Overwatch shot. We'll see about that, and it doesn't look like it triggered over. Well, chrysalids. Okay, the baby chrysalids have six health and one armor. Okay. You go, resistant soldiers. For some reason, I thought the chrysalid was going to attack the turn it came out. That's why I was so insistent on overwatching it. Kill Utah? So low on HP? Aw, oh, that was a good try. Okay. Let's get a high roll here, that'd be pretty cool. Okay. Oh, we can't see the chrysalid, are you kidding me? Ugh. Okay, well. Target neutralized. I mean, I guess that just means we're not shooting it. Okay, that's a guaranteed kill. Okay, I need to do something about that Berserker. Do I just double heal Snake and hope that that's enough? Actually, how much... How much damage can a Berserker do? What's the maximum damage a Berserker can do? Nobody can see the Berserker. Um, okay, well, let's just... Um, I guess our Grenadier is going to shoot the Chrysalid, because he doesn't have much that's better to do. Awesome. 
Um, okay, they really want to keep my ranger alive. If I can't think of a better way to keep my ranger alive, I can just frost bomb these two enemies. Then a chrysalid cocoon. Okay, well then I have to... Then this 35 health and one armor split between those two enemies will be kind of a lot to deal with. On the move. Just go over here. Oh, I could have put my... Did I get untouchable from killing a crystal cocoon? I feel like I probably did. Oh, we have... Um, we have combat protocol, so even if we use a gremlin heal, for this is going to heal for 7. I'm just going to heal up to 10, which is not enough to survive a crit, I don't think. Anyway, oh, you know what we can do? We can go over here. Yeah, this will get us vision on all of the enemies. Alright, Berserker, how much damage do you do? Okay. So, I don't know how much damage it does. So I guess in that case, I probably need to freeze the Berserker. Actually, okay, how much health? Okay, what's the... 12 max health. I think even on a crit, a Berserker cannot do 12 damage. So if I fully heal, we'll be fine. Um, Fire in the hole. Another Frost Bomb. Make sure to stay away Servos from the, uh, whatever civilian is going to become a faceless. I thought I, I thought I somehow had like another action available. I, I never actually made a plan of how I was going to kill the Mutant. Whoops. Oh, and I forgot about the back. Okay. Well. Yeah, I guess I just have to hope the Muton doesn't kill anyone. Unconscious means that the Muton won't attack him, so we're fine there. And a dead civilian means we're not losing a, an XCOM soldier. <laughs> Alright, well that's a guaranteed hit at least. Okay, so I need to kill the specter. Oh, I have two people who are unconscious right now. One of them from the specter, and the other one just unconscious because he got punched by a berserker. Okay. Um, so now, uh, where's my face off when I need it? Oh, okay. So the only target I can frostbite from here is the berserker. Okay, so I'll just do that. Make it lose a turn. Um, okay. I think I need to brute force this shot. Oh, well, first try. Hostile 
it down. Well, I just took care of three enemies in one turn, so that's pretty good. Um, now, all I gotta do is... Oh, let's revive... Yeah, let's revive the person who got knocked out. The other person will just get up automatically once I kill the specter. So that's what we're going to do next. 8 to 10 damage. Okay, cool. On reserves. And, okay, 6 more damage. Do I have a... Okay, the spark doesn't have a good... Oh. Oh, the specter is... Oh, I can hit the specter Roger from that. And it's guaranteed because we stacked aim on our grenadier. Hostile neutralized. Okay. Roger that. So, yeah, we're not close enough to get a sword attack, but what we can do is toss a grenade here. I think that will not hit any civilians. Wow, this spark is really having trouble getting line of sight on anything. I'm on my way. Okay. Oh. So the other cocoon that popped out of chrysalid, it did not attack immediately. So I think that means I should be shooting the berserk, and they can deal with the cocoon next. Depletion. Hotel I six. require additional ammo. Moving to position. Okay, cool. Target neutral. So there should not be anything attacking this turn. Really, you're not shooting the Berserker who has negative 10 defense? Okay. <laughs> I feel like Crystal Cocoon should be easier to hit than an ordinary person. But that's alright. Well, we only lost three civilians, so that's not bad. They just refuse to hit enemies that are frozen. Affirmative, moving out. Oh well, first. Reload. Yeah, we'll hit this down to low health. We don't even want to give the kills to. Well, this person's still a sergeant. So, yeah, that's a good start. On the move. I also have to kill a face. Alright. Target neutralized. And. Alright, which of these people wants this kill? Probably... Way. I don't know. The rangers get... Rangers get really good abilities at higher levels. Here. I mean, every class does, but especially the ranger. So we'll give... I forgot to give him an axe. 
target down. Menace one five, you've secured the remaining civilians, and there are no other hostile contacts on the scope. Good work out there. <laughs> Soldiers killed. Oh yeah, the stun lancer. The poor stun lancer. It deserved better than to have its life be thrown away just to Even maybe now, save one more civilian. Lurks in the shadows, plotting to destroy all we have built. To return us to the chaos of the old world. Only together can we oppose them. United in the elders. Hey, the speaker does get a little bit repetitive when you hear him at the end of every mission. No matter the cost. Alright. Those are very short wounded tyrants. That's cool. Want both of those, so. Hello, Commander. Um. All right. And Lieutenant Charles Edwards is the person who just promoted, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and this um, Grenadier already has both of these. And this other Grenadier probably also has both of those abilities, but I can't check right now. I want another resistance contact. I think at this point I don't need any more resistance contacts because I can build a... Uh... Just what are you and the Reapers up to, Commander? I think I just build, I'm going to be building resistance comms anyway. If they don't turn on you first. Well, Avenger I'm getting powered armor course. in six days, which means I should finally get around to getting this supply drop. And since I'm getting the supply drop, oh, I'm already building resistance comms. Uh, okay, what do my wounded timers look like? I think if they doubled mysteriously, that would be fine. So let's put Daniel Walsh here. I still don't have a plan of how I'm going to prevent the Avatar project in the near future. All right. Um. Well, let's get a radio tower then. Okay, there's. Either radio towers is relevant for US actually precinct. positioning for contacts, so whatever. Just build one there because it's closer to where I want to be. There were some casualties during that last covert action, Commander, but our troops will all recover after some well earned rest. Together, we have learned even more about the chosen that pursue you, Commander. Right. If we want to take out the Chosen once and for all, we should well, move we to strike their stronghold. Over action. The Resistance has found our access point. Um, we just have to make use of it. Our understanding don't need of the Elders' vision has grown. And Sabotage is new ways really good. To crush their efforts. I think... Um... Although I think I might actually just lose, or I would I might be forced to use my uh, facility lead if I don't reduce Avatar Project progress now. Okay, well I want plus three aim more than I want plus four will. Oh yeah, so we want this resistance order and yeah, we don't need anything else here. Okay, um, yeah, so plus three aim goes to a sharpshooter, I guess, and where's Maria Peters? Wounded, okay. Um, I 
Can I just... Did I just bring my skirmisher again? I've been bringing my skirmisher on a lot of covert actions. Which is fine. I guess. I want a special ammo type on him. Dragon runs are pretty good against the Lost. Um, and I, I can't bring my Skirmisher's teamwork buddy unless I want to take him out of negative retreat recovery, which I don't. Okay. Do I have extra Talon rounds? Yes, I do. I remember specifically getting two of every type of ammunition. I remember being upset that we'll I get the job done. Don't worry, had to... <laughs> that the Talon rounds was the last one that I got two of. Skull mining is... well... I'm gonna need 600 supplies for the armor upgrade, so... Well, actually, I'm gonna get some supplies from shielding the power coil, so... Yeah, sure. Sounds good, Commander. I'll let you know as soon as the project is ready for deployment. Uh, just kidding, I didn't get any supplies from that. Alright. But, which one do I want to be... I think I actually want to rush out clearing alien debris. Okay, so we'll put Minjoo Park here. And a big part of the reason is that... Actually, I just want to turbo both them out. I don't need the resistance. Well... No, I do want the resistance comms sooner rather than later. Okay. When inspired, our team is actually quite efficient. <laughs> All right. This, as if the typical muton wasn't aggressive Finally, enough. I have enough. This whole biometal corpse and wonder how the aliens can research. conceive of such a being. Physically, these shield bearers are not all that dissimilar from their various advent peers. Um, their armor okay. is perhaps the most distinctive feature differentiating them. Yeah, why not? You haven't done the Archon aut Autopsy yet. Okay. I will make that our highest I'm not in a priority. huge hurry to get beam weapons. I... Oh, yeah, because I, I went below 600 supplies thinking that shielding the power coil was going to get me some more. Um, oh, I was like, I just got a supply drop. No, I did not get a supply drop. I finished a research. Okay. Well, let's look at these events. I don't care about spider and fly. It's more of a nuisance than an actual threat. Loyalty among thieves is also just kind of a nuisance. So I guess we're countering this hidden dark event. And if with only 13 enemies, well, only 13, only 11, only 13. Um, as long as I have, setting course for the Chilean as long as I, I, I don't district. think I need the armor upgrade right now. Like, knowing that every enemy is going to be mechanical means I can just bring blue screen rounds on. Commander, we'll need to have, have one of our troops equip the Skulljack for use in the field if we're going to make any progress towards our current objective. Alright. So, sharpshooters have a very good synergy with or can, can use blue screen rounds very well. Grenadiers, like I would also like to have a grenadier on the mission, but that's not going to happen. So, just bring a pair of sharpshooters. This is going to be a training mission. Just bring my lowest level sharpshooters, and then Templars are not great against mechs. 
so maybe I don't need to I also don't get concealment for the rest of the game. Which is probably fine. Maybe I just... Okay, where's Emma Cone? Oh, okay, I can bring these two people. I think I only have two screen pads. So... I'll just go up to six blue screen pads. I guess I can't upgrade my armor anyway. I'll just do it next month. And I'll sell some stuff in the black market. Anyway. Um, okay, two sharpshooters, a ranger, a specialist, and... Maybe a third sharpshooter. Yeah. Maybe... So what classes do I even have available? Okay, I do have another ranger. And I do have another specialist. Okay, sure. Well let's unequip for parents. Alright. Do I want plasma rifles? No, I think I need that point blank accuracy. Very high accuracy in close range. Okay. Oh, we have a spider suit available. Although I think that's better for the uh, sharpshooters. This person she needs to get a spider suit. Alright, the mission is to protect the device, so we're not going to be hacking anything, so I don't need the plus 20 hack from the skull jack. Also, yeah, it's plus. Actually, let's see, I'm just going to select it. Oh, we don't have the small mine ability yet. Okay, fine. And... Okay, what else? Well, somebody should have the frost bomb. And also the ionic axe. How many PCS do I have? Uh, just plus 15 dodge. Like, I don't even know if this is good on Sky Ranger deployed. Probably a Templar. In Seems like the most natural thing. My Templar has plus three health already. So maybe a Ranger, maybe a Skirmisher? I don't know. The thing is, your soldiers don't really survive enough shots for the... for like a plus 11 dodge move to really do much. Like, the chance that it does anything is not high at all. Word has it the resistance has been pulling hey, data well, critical to the alien's latest project we're from almost the at using something they rigged up in armor. this area. So, we're gonna get that soon, but for now, we're gonna call it, and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.